we're overclocking the AMD Ryzen 7 8700G APU up to 5.35 GHz in 5 minutes or less using the Asus ROG X670E i Gaming Wi-Fi motherboard and EK Quantum Custom Loop water cooling. I'll speed run you through the BIOS settings and provide some notes and tips along the way. Please note that this is for entertainment purposes only and not the whole picture. If you want to overclock this kind of a system, have a look at the longer Scatterbencher video that's already up on this channel. All right, let's do this. When you've entered the BIOS, switch to the advanced mode view and stay in the AI tweaker menu. Set AI overclock tuner to Expo 1. That makes the memory run at our Expo rated frequency of DDR5 6400 and timings. Expo 1 will load only the primary timings and have the motherboard tune the secondary timings. Enter the Precision Boost Overdrive submenu. Here we can use the AMD Precision Boost Overdrive 2 toolkit to increase the power, current and frequency headroom of the Precision Boost 2 boost algorithm. Set Precision Boost Overdrive to Enabled. This adjusts the PBO platform parameters, PPT, TDC and EDC according to the motherboard auto rules. On this motherboard we find that the following values have changed. The main bottleneck for maximizing system performance are the power limits, in particular the STAPM and PPT limiter. STAPM is an acronym for Skin Temperature Aware Power Management and is primarily relevant for mobile devices. Enabling PBO should raise both STAPM and PPT limit. However, if it doesn't automatically adjust the STAPM limit, then you may have to manually adjust the setting as I'll show later on. Set Precision Boost Overdrive Scaler to Manual. Scaler is a tool that allows the user to override the Warranted Silicon Stress Level, or FIT, to achieve a higher frequency. Increasing the scaler allows the CPU to pursue higher voltages under load. Set Customized Precision Boost Overdrive Scaler to 10x. Set CPU Boost Clock Override to Enabled Positive. That unlocks the ability to increase the CPU's programmed F-max, or maximum frequency, up to 200 MHz in steps of 25 MHz. Note that the standard F-max for the 8700G is 5150 MHz. Remarkably, every core in this CPU can boost to an effective clock matching the F-max of 5150 MHz at stock. The CPU boosts to 4829 MHz when all cores are active. Set Max CPU Boost Clock Override to 200. This increases the F-Max by 200 MHz, so the new F-Max for the CPU is 5350 MHz. Enter the Curve Optimizer submenu. Here's where the real magic happens, as Curve Optimizer allows us to fine-tune the VF curve for each core in a positive or negative direction. Each step represents around 5 mV. Set Curve Optimizer to Per Core. Set Core 0 to Core 7 Curve Optimizer Sign to Negative. Setting a negative offset means the CPU will use less voltage for a given frequency and boost to a higher frequency at a specific voltage. Note that the Curve Optimizer settings are highly CPU specific, so you should find the best values for your CPU rather than copying mine. I set the Curve Optimizer Magnitude for each core according to my test result. The Core Optimizer Magnitude results range from minus 50 to minus 25. Despite the aggressive undervolt with Curve Optimizer and a raised F-max of 5350 MHz, none of the cores achieve an effective clock matching the new F-max. However, the CPU now boosts to 5128 MHz when all cores are active. If enabling Precision Boost Overdrive doesn't adjust the STAPM limit, then switch to the Advanced menu, enter the AMD CBS submenu, enter the SMU Common Options submenu, enter the Smart Shift Control submenu, set Smart Shift Control to Manual, set Sustained Power Limit to 1 million, then save and exit the BIOS. We rerun some benchmarks to ensure everything works as intended and check the performance increase compared to the default settings. Higher is better and all of our benchmark scores are higher. We see a maximum performance increase of plus 24.93% in AI benchmark. The highest core clock reported in the operating system is 5350 MHz. 
When running the OCCT CPU SSE stability test, the average CPU core effective clock is 5053 MHz with 1.288 volts. The average CPU package power is 125.8 watts. And that's it. I thank you for watching and I thank the patrons for the support and see you next time.